what's going on everybody welcome back to mama man's kitchen yes again it's been a minute but you know i've been working y'all for real i've been doing things for you know filming working on new music working on my way to the stellas what i'm excited about the stellas this year but anyway y'all i am so happy to have someone join me you know he back by popular d-man Y'all already know who it is. You know, we just do things like that together. But welcome back to the, look, welcome back to the stage. Okay, this time. Welcome back to the kitchen. Thank you very much, thank oh, you very you, much. Okay. This time. Don't give it much, that's thank it. You. Thank you, well they the one, you asked them and they said what? They wanted you? Yes, they wanted me. Oh, okay, Now this time, I know last time I was in the kitchen. Yeah, he, you know what? My guest, my special guest. It was a kitchen disaster. God bless. <laughs> It, it was, but it turned out good though. The, the food turned out, the omelet turned out great. But David, you know. What was you, funny about that? Because we just didn't, you know, that's the, the importance of talking and making sure that you communicate. You the one dropped the thing. That we communicate now, and we're not going She still haven't admitted that she moved the plate. But y'all listen to it now, you, I thought. You, I, that's when somebody about to lie. But it, it's not about to lie. But anyway, you know what, y'all? I enjoy cooking. Again, for those who maybe this is your first time watching, we're not chefs, but we love to cook. Love, And love, we love, love to have family over, and we're cooking like today. We're cooking quite a bit because we got people over, coming right. over. Y'all know I'm all into cooking quick meals. Today, we're doing Salisbury steak. Mm -hmm. We're doing beef and we're doing for the people who don't eat beef anymore, but they get the vegetarian. vegetarian. Fake. You don't call it fake meat because that's, that's yeah, the insult. They get the, the faux meat. But the, not for real meat. <laughs> okay, but so we're going to have mashed potatoes. I already got my potatoes going, y'all. And I always like to use the the uh, golden potatoes. To me, I've learned that they make a better mashed uh, swip. Mashed potato. They make a better mashed a potato. A mashed sweet potato? No, Not just sweet, regular no. mashed potato. A better mashed potato. So we having corn. David wants a special request. I'm making cream corn. His mama's cream corn. Cream stewed corn. So, okay. He's going to do that. Okay. Let, you know, my, you know, he kind of a little messy, you know, so we just pray that we keep everything together a little bit. Not messy is another what is, word what's for So what's the other word? I like my stuff unorganized a little bit. Okay. Anyway, and also we're having broccoli, so we are having a veggie. And if you want to, you know, you can add cheese to it, put a little Parmesan, whatever you want to do for your family to kind of brighten it up for our young people, because a lot of people, I don't even say young people, because we got old people too that don't like to eat green right. vegetables. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what, so look at me? We got our skillets kind of heating up everybody, okay. but. Oh, we, I gotta wash my hands. Yeah, we're gonna, okay, well, let's wash our hands. Yeah, you, well, you, you wash you hands, yours. I wash my hands, but I got my, I got cube steak here that you can buy in the store, already pre-made, or you can just use hamburger patties. You don't even have to use cube steak, but I just like to use cube steak. And we made the this impossible, the new impossible meat, y'all, that's less in sodium. So we got the light one, which is less sodium on it, but we added a little seasoning in there. And we're gonna put my special seasoning I'm ready on to there. Oh. It's coming soon. My apron. Oh yeah, let my me apron. grab the apron. Okay, right you quick. get the apron. All right, so I'm heating my skillet up because y'all know I'm try not trying to keep y'all in right, the kitchen I got all day. It here. All right, so we're gonna put this got it blend up. on our seasoning. So hey, why you, David? Why uh -oh. you getting up? Get my get my apron too. You know, I'm on my man's apron. The stain did the stain come out? Okay, yeah, the stain came out. Oh, that's good. That's good. Tied to okay. the rescue. All right, so we see. Right and white. Y'all put a little bit. Don't go too heavy, Damn. but. I'll that stuff really food. works. A whole lot of salt in it, so you ain't got to worry. Let's cook. So you got it? You got it? Okay, I got I'm gonna I'm put my I'm gonna put my apron on. Hey. Okay. You my got it? You can't tell mine from yours now. You can't. Ty did it right. Ty did it right. Ty did it right. All right, let's. let's you gotta help me with mine because I got these little alligator arms. I can't get it around. Okay. okay well, then he Look. said alligator arms. Actually, you know, you got T Rex arms like yeah. your mama. Uh oh. Sorry. Oh. Did, did I say that out loud? Did I say that out loud? Cause his mama's arms. That's your mom. So her arms is short like that. We yep. know your mama can't wash. Well, my mama, my mama gone on be with the Lord. And she can't wash. She could have used Tide with the way she washed. She One couldn't time, wash. One time her mama actually bleached 
a pair of my black Will pants. Would you? Would she? Hey, the only church pants that I had. It wasn't she, only. Now why you gonna stop that? Mama, I didn't have like only that. one black. Wash my hands again. Why are you gonna she tell that story? She bleached them. I came home and I see my good church pants with bleach stains. Now why are you gonna say that about my mama? See, back in the day, if we'd had that tied right like that, she would have done it up, but she didn't. And See, she went on to be with Glory and never bought me She the went pants. on to be with Glory. <laughs> went on to be, went on to Glory and didn't give me my pants. Well, I mean, hey, don't, oh, you, don't, don't talk about my mom's short Come. You forgot to tell him. Now, Tam makes this punch. Yeah, I make that punch. Just, yeah, yeah, keep, hold, keep we call it this crack punch in our house. All right, I'm still seasoning. We, it's because it's good. Mm -hmm. But it's really simple, y'all. All it is, that punch is pineapple juice. Pineapple juice. Orange juice. Orange juice. And grenadine. You gotta show them how to make it just quick one day. I'm gonna I'm show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all. But I gotta put this seasoning on here because mm -hmm. one thing you don't want is bland food. No. So you, nothing you, like bland food. It, it's nothing like. Okay. Did so did you tell them that your season don't have a lot of salt? It don't have a lot of sodium in it. A lot yeah. of salt. Yeah. So it this, but it got a, but it got flavor. Yeah. How about that? Like this. How about that? You got that. Yep. So we got that going. Can you put me a little oil in this skillet? Okay. Just make sure that you put it on both sides. My new little setup right there. I got, you know, I, y'all, I, while we was gone, I did some renovations. I, you know, it's not red anymore. I have blue in the kitchen. Oh, yeah. But Is I that still. Uh, a little more? Just a little bit. A little bit more. Because I'm going to add some onions in there and bell pepper. So this is right here. This I already have. This I'm don't come out just a lot put a like little that. seasoning on this one. It don't come out? You don't it like don't come it? A lot. Well, you know. I mean, I think it's that's good. That's okay, good. Okay, we're good. But that but the thing about it is, y'all, I, I honestly, y'all, I love being in the kitchen. I, I just And she I, loved being in the kitchen with me. Sometimes. Why did it get quiet? Cause sometimes, cause my husband, y'all, he just when he come in the kitchen, he come in here, he wanna tell everybody how to cook. Like he, you know, number when one you're chef. Professional, you're professional. Like he the number one chef in the world. And we'll move that back there. But he, okay, I'm going to turn my potato. Yeah, yeah, I got my potatoes going. Okay, yeah, we can put and the top she, so they can get soft. Is it hot? Yeah, it's hot. Okay, so we're going to put, you ready? It's hotter than a broke you, prostitute. But you always said it need to be hot, so why you, what? I shouldn't have said that. Bro. No, you shouldn't have said Some that. Some stuff I forget how I'm you, on. I'm, how you know? No, I never, you a lie. Wait a minute. <laughs> well, I was, you just Okay, here we go. Uh, okay, here we go. I, I'm ready. Put, what, you took it off the fire? Oh, okay, so I, didn't, I didn't know if you were ready. No, I'm ready. Cause what I'm gonna do is, y'all hear that? It's hot, nice and hot. So, so we can get everything going. I'm gonna put a couple of the regular beef, and then I'm gonna put some of the not so real meat in there. Yeah, that. Thelum, you know my brother-in-law. He used to be my number one favorite person to cook for. Now he don't want to eat meat no more. So, but just so I can have my onion flavor, y'all, I'm gonna add some. I just want this to cook down in it so you can have that onion flavor on this. Cause once it gets cooked down, we're gonna let this actually kind of simmer and get all tenderized. All right, so we browning that. Let me put this in the sink. Y'all know I Ma like it. Uh oh. Wait, wait a minute. Wait. Y'all, see this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. See right here? I see my, my, my messy cook. My messy cook. But that, that, Okay, so what you waiting for? Get the paper I, towel. I got, some, I got something for that. Bam. The quicker pickup, I got something for that. There. Look. Look. Jumbo. The Look. four in one roll quicker picker up. Four in one. That four. is a huge roll of paper towels. It's a plus size paper towel. It's plus size? It's the ultra, ultra big. <laughs> Look. The mega. I love how you said it's plus size. you know, size. I like the plus side. Well, you know. I we, love me some plus side. That's what we do. So you, with this, you get more and have to use less. Watch this, dude. Look, I only, that, you can't beat that. Look at it, you know what? That worked good. That definitely worked good. You know how you see something on TV and you think, that ain't gonna work. You get more and use less. Wow. Careful not to spill your beverages. <laughs> Look how it's absorbed. You got to get in there and get that. Bam! All right, it the works. The mega roll works. It works. So we got we got our chop steak and okay. our beyond meat cooking down. Okay, I'm not going to make a mess again, but okay. I'm still going to have some of this punch. 
All right. So while that's cooking down, we check it on our potatoes. So how you check your potatoes to see if they done, y'all, is you stick a fork in it. And it's done. And they done. So what we need to do now, cut that off. We can drain the water off of that. That you? That's me. I'm about to make my... We'll let our broccoli, broccoli gonna be last though. Okay. Broccoli gonna be last. And you gonna start your corn? You tell me. Is yep. that what I'm doing? Yep. Okay, so what do I need to do with the corn? How do I need to make that happen? How you, you got your... It's a little hot. It's, it's a little bit. You, you probably give yourself a little bit more heat. Okay. She's so bossy in the kitchen. I'm not bossy. Just a little, I said a little bit more heat. So you're gonna put your butter in there. Okay. You're gonna stick of butter. Uh-huh. Salt and pepper, let yeah. that melt down, then you're gonna add you some onions, and you're mm -hmm. gonna add your corn. Okay. So what we use is, we use frozen corn because it just comes out a little bit more firmer okay. than- And it won't get soggy quick. Huh? Like, yes, yeah, like you using the can. I mean, but you can use canned corn, it's still gonna work out the same way, but I just like to use frozen corn. And then last, you're gonna add some half of this, which okay. will be like a half a cup of bell pepper, and we use all the different color of bell pepper. We're not gonna make it real spicy since we have people that don't like spice. Like my brother, he right. had this little tongue. He had the tongue of a toddler. <laughs> it's too hot! Oh my God, it's too hot! And then you're gonna add also cream cheese, a block of cream cheese. Cream cheese, okay, so let that cook down a little bit. Yeah, you gotta put all that corn in there. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. So Look you at that. Making a mess. Always, that's, that's, is it in your spirit? Yes, I married a mess. No, you didn't marry no mess. <laughs> you just makes a mess. You didn't okay, marry yeah, we'll one. Put this over here. Look, look. And y'all, he always wants somebody to clean up after him. That's the thing, is he wanna cook, but he don't wanna clean up. Who you think you got one? you think you got enough you got enough butter in there? I may have to add a little bit more. A little we'll bit add more. Add a little more butter, really. Yeah, just a little bit more butter in there. I'm gonna put a half of You know what aprons are for? To this wipe, is what aprons are for. To wipe your hands on? That's what aprons are for, right? There. Right, it is. And sometimes you can just take it. And no, wipe don't it on wipe it on else. mine. I'm, I'm that's just showing how how clean I can stay. Hey, okay, I'm, I'm so I'll put my top on. Late. Let that sit. That's, you good? You I'm had good. It. I put that in there. Your meat is good. You're gonna make gravy on that too. Yes. Right? So I'm gonna take the. I'm gonna actually. We're gonna do a cheat. Okay, what's the cheat? The cheat is. Here I have. What's all of that for? What's your mushrooms for? To add into the side of here. And okay. we'll get ready to make the gravy. So I need to get a bowl. Can you give me a bowl out of the top? All right. We're gonna take the meat out. Cause what happens is the rest of the way to cook the meat is we're gonna actually simmer it so it can tenderize. You got a nice you want size this one? bowl? No, this no, no, no. Big one. one of the glass bowls. No, you gotta be pretty. Uh-uh. Oh. Right there. One of the glass bowls. Right okay. there. Yeah. This one? Yes, sir. So back to the gravy. So what I did is I have two packages of actually gravy that's in the package that to cheat, to make it easy for you. Now next time I'm gonna come back and show y'all how to make homemade gravy. So we have two cups of water. Two I, cups of water. Two cups of water already here. Two cups of water already wet. Okay, can you just take this meat and put this in here? Okay, put the meat in here. Mm -hmm. now, 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 be careful, don't break up. My, okay, we want don't the meat to stay. Yeah, not we don't want broke so because Lord knows you don't want broke meat. Yeah, here, yeah, because that that it, so we got two cups of water right here. Also, we have beef broth. Let me stir that for you. That right there, that's where your good stuff happens, right me, in the I'm, bottom. I'm stirring all that up so we can add this in. So this makes it easier for you if you don't know how to make gravy. They make gravy that you can buy. You ain't gotta be trying to stress out to them. I don't know how to make it. So there's no excuse that you still can get the same effect. So we got our onions, bell That's pepper. Good stuff, man. I'm actually gonna add me a little bit more onion in there. I'm gonna be your stirrer. And I'm gonna add a little bit of this. <laughs> some That's mushrooms like, and that. That's like a you couple want a little mushrooms. More oil? No? no. Okay. Because I'm gonna add this in there and then you can just stir it. Now this is one thing, this is on a serious note. Like these cooking together and being in the kitchen together actually it's, it's, it's really fun. good for your marriage. Yes. Kind of helps build because listening skills and, and communication mm -hmm. skills. So we adding the, the chicken broth because you got to stir that up. Baby. Okay. So we're going to let all of that, the stirring seeds, but it's going to thicken. It's going to thicken for you to make oh, it cool. great. See, it's already starting to thicken. Now this is something that I'm not that great at making gravy. I try to do it 
Yeah. And it just get too thick. And we're gonna add all of that in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this actually helps build good team building skills between you and your, your spouse. So this was like two, depending on how big of serving or how many people you're making it for, one package with one cup of broth. You can use chicken or beef broth. Mm -hmm. Then you're gonna add your meat back inside of it and it's gonna just cook down. Babe, we you gotta stir that. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So it's cooking down. Yeah. So as that's cooking down. So when do I add the cream cheese? Damn. Actually add your bell pepper. Okay. And add the cream cheese, it's gonna a take a minute. salt and pepper? Yeah, your salt and pepper. Then you just, salt and pepper's right there. Mm -hmm. She always be like, it's right there. Like, I, this is my kitchen too. What? I designed the thing. But he don't know. Okay. <laughs> what are you gonna tell him I don't know? Cause you just, you just said you designed it. So the salt, salt and pepper, you knew that was well, right you, there? No, you made that. Okay, look. She made this little thing, so it's not- So, no, I, but tell them what you just told me. I just they, found out today that this little thing, you can pick it up like this. All this time, I just been sliding it off. So, I did oh, I don't want to drop that. Oh, I will. oh Lord. So now, y'all, we putting the meat back inside. Put that back inside good. the gravy. So we're gonna cook down our mushrooms, let the meat tenderize. Okay. So see, even that being brown, but you want it to be brown, cause all that brown gonna crystallize and make your gravy. Crystallize. Yeah, it's gonna make your gravy. Okay, I'm gonna put a little, flavor. put a little bell pepper, a little red, yellow, and green. I call this Christmas bell pepper. Mm -hmm. That's good, I just had half of it. That's good, oh, that's okay. good. Woo! Look at that, look at the color. His hands is heavy. Now, you need to put the cream cheese in it. That's why you, why you married me. You didn't marry me because I got light hands. Oh, God. You wanted a heavy hand man. Oh. See, I pride myself on being well-rounded. You are. I can come in the house, grease your scalp, and put a perm on your hair. Mm. Go outside, change your tire, kill a bear, come back in, give you a bath, put you to bed, and say good night. You got to be well-rounded. So that's going a little quick. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna add me a little water. Okay, and while you're doing that, I'll, do I add my cream cheese in it slowly? No, you can put all of it in it. All at one time? Yeah, just, okay. just spread it out. Now, my mom makes this dish, and I'm making it. I didn't call and ask her, could I make it? So she probably, when she see this, she gonna probably be like, they done took another recipe from me. Y'all, what's funny is David mama like. You about to get in trouble when you say this. You mm. know you about to get in trouble. My God. Go ahead and say it, man. I wanna add a little bit more water, I'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> so my mama, when she, we got married, you know, my mom, really good cook. But then Tam started learning how to make all the dishes that my mom made. Cause that's what he liked. So I just, I just learned how to make them. So now he was like, she, now she's like, huh. she yeah. done took the it taste out of his mouth. mouth. Cause she, now she done, she make everything. He, she put sugar in everything. I ain't put sugar in nothing today. But, but I think she I- said you done, You gonna I get just, in trouble for that. Mama, I didn't have nothing to do with this. She said all of that. <laughs> so we gonna simmer this. We gonna simmer now, this. I will this. say this. What is it? You can't make this dude corn like my mama. You do all right. Oh, what? No. Now, I'm going to tell you that. You can't make this corn <laughs> like my mama. I'm going to tell you that. OK, OK. But see, that, that's And good. her cherry cheese pie, that's what we got to get her on here to do. I don't do. even like that. Well, she don't do cherry cheese pie, but I do. Tell you, I'm hating today. I'm not hating. I just, it's not my favorite. Now, she have no, she, she, I do like a corn. No, y'all know what I love? Oh. I love her. Okay. Casserole. Tuna, tuna casserole. casserole her broccoli we got to get her to make that. That broccoli casserole, that's a family favorite. Cherry oh. cheese pie, the broccoli casserole. Mm hmm. Now Put that, a little boy, salt in there. That right there, that tastes amazing. I just dropping a little salt in there. Okay, I'm going to get a top and let that simmer down, y'all. Let that simmer down, y'all. I got to stir it, right? <laughs> yeah, you make sure you stir it. Let the cream cheese do what it do. Mm hmm. All right. And break that's down. Good. So the cream cheese will. Cream cheese a lot. Yes, it'll break down. So you probably- That is a word, cream cheese a lot. It's not a word. And while you're doing all of that, I'm gonna take the potatoes and drain the water off so all we right. can start the mashed potatoes. Okay, and then I'll stir this, let it do what it do. Okay, I got my corn. Your cream corn. Cream hey, look, corn. That looks amazing. Mama would be proud. Yes, she would. Yes, she would. I started uh, mashing our mashed potatoes. I added 
heavy cream, mm -hmm. and we're adding chicken broth. So I'm gonna just, and I add also a stick of butter. So we're gonna get that real nice and smooth, get all our knots out. You, you gotta be honest, you do enjoy me being in the kitchen. I do enjoy you being in the kitchen. Y'all enjoy me? Y'all gotta vote me back to come because sometimes, you know, she'll go like 10 episodes and won't have me in the kitchen. He's vote, but we gotta vote you back? They, they voted me in. I tell you what we have had. The rain, y'all, we've been trying to shoot videos for the upcoming music. Yeah. We've been trying to, we can't. Too much rain. We got rained out of the extravaganza. The, we had to cancel the family reunion. We had a record amount of rain. And where there's rain, there's flies, gnats, and everything oh, else. Oh my. And they've been terrible. I, my, let me tell you, my mama, if a fly gets in the kitchen with my mama, right. the whole meal is ruined. You can't eat nothing. So, but we don't have to worry about that because- We don't. Why? We discovered a new product. A very nice product that I like. Cause this one- Cause I be trying to create like the home remedies to try to get to do this. Y'all. To catch flies and gnats and stuff. Vinegar and stuff, uh-uh. Hey. It, no, it but, stinks. Okay. But, but we don't have to worry about that no more. Right, because of- Zevo. <laughs> we have discovered a new product. Zevo, catch gnats. The fruit flies, meat flies, whatever flies in the kitchen, it'll catch it. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Lord. Because she will go nuts if she see a fly in the kitchen. That a fly? Yes. The whole thing is ruined. This Bay is flies in here. You need to spray. But you, but I mean, who wants flies in the kitchen or gnats when you try to? We don't even have to worry about it because I created a Zevo Fortress in the kitchen. I created a no fly zone. A no fly zone. Let me show you. I appreciate that. Come here right quick. With Zevo, all you got to do, take it. Plug it in, you see the blue light? The blue light means it's working. And the blue light attracts them, get them in, trap them on the little stick, they can't get up. They do what to them? They trap on the stick and they be doing no, like this. No, but what's the to... first quarter? And then they trap on the stick and they can't get off. Zebo. something hey. we discovered new, is new for us. I, I heard it, it could have been around, but it's new for us. Hey, so I, I want you to taste these. I'm gonna add No them. more flies in the kitchen for us. Okay. I'm gonna add just a little bit of salt, y'all. Okay. That's probably about a half teaspoon. You gotta, you gotta, you know, you gotta. You better cook, because another thing happened during the recording. Excuse, her recording. Excuse the noise. She, she hurt her arm, we I couldn't see. record. I'm like, rain. That was the devil. It was the devil. Whenever you get ready to do a project of significance. I mean, he show his ugly head. He right. show his face up. But, we but God, you look, I couldn't even let, I couldn't even lift my hand up. Y'all had to lift my hand like this. She was walking around like. Ah! Glory. Look there. I got she was walking around like oh, this. Oh, oh, I'm back. I'm back. Oh, oh, I said, Lord, I need the activities of my limbs. I need my arms to work. That's the way she was doing. She was. And I was crying. I was crying. You ain't got to do that, though. I said, you all right, babe? Take these potatoes. See that's, see, that's people this. Well, I'm just showing you them. You don't talk about your wife like that. You was talking about my mama. Well, just, I, and I just don't talk man, about just, your mama. Man, just taste the taste And your the daddy. Taste. I don't talk about your daddy. I've got either. my hot water going. We about to do our broccoli. Whoever he is. See, that's, see, that's how you. That's good. Ain't that something? Let me see another one. No, don't, don't hold on. Let me, I got to put my, I like to clean up that behind myself, y'all. I like to clean up behind yourself, too. See, that's, you said, that sound nasty. That's really good. You, oh, let me do yeah, it. Cut yours off. You don't want oh, that. It's going to You got to show them. Get in there. Mason, get in there where you can see that. Let's stare it. Oh. Yeah, because you have to keep staring keep it, though, y'all. Keep it watching them because it, it will stick. That's good. That's good. You cut it out? Yep, I turned it off. All oh, right. you got to do your broccoli, mom. I got to do my broccoli. Look, broccoli. Hey, check that out. She said the broccoli for last. I put, oh. I put this back there on You can simmer. turn it off. Woo! That's Ooh. good. We don't even this need This is them. Salisbury steak. We got the beef and we got the impossible, impossible. not real meat. But look at that. Y'all see that? That's good. That, don't that's... that pretty. Okay, let me get me a... Don't that pretty. You know what's something that people don't you should have in your pretty. kitchen? Look. Don't that pretty. You should have in your kitchen these little tasting spoons and forks. And forks yep. Just go buy yep. you a bunch of them like that. Real easy. Yeah, you, I know, we, we're a little extra, y'all. No, you extra. I am really but quiet. But you a gadget it. person, too. Okay, I'm, let me taste your corn. Okay, I'm gonna put this on the side, y'all. So let me, let, let. Uh -uh. I'm done. Yeah. Ain't that much, ain't that much, now look here. Ain't that much, ain't that much tasting that you gotta throw that, 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 that poon like that. You ain't, gotta taste one of them. But, but, Taste some of that. that much? It need, I think it needs just a little, little, little salt. Just a little. That's good. 
Y'all was, chase it over there and spit it back in there. When I was, he gonna spit, I just didn't want to drop it. Oh. It's good, ain't it? Mmm, mmm. That's a, we don't even I need none wish, of the, I just wish we could have made it spicier. Yeah, but my brother got to eat it. Because he was just. This one. Oh, okay, he think bell peppers are hot. He hey, probably think salt is hot. And that's my younger brother. He he married. Yeah, married. Let he me married. say that. He's married. He's happily married. Yep. Yeah. He, he got <laughs> his wife is back to saying happily. <laughs> so I'm cutting this off. I already rinsed my broccoli off, y'all, but I'm I just want to make nice furrow. So I, I got the got the water on. Water's boiling, mama. Can you put me a what's that? Add me a little 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 your this, seasoned blend in the in the water. Just these are Tam's little secret seasoned blends. You gotta catch me getting it in there. Get it in there. You gotta catch me getting it in there. What? Get but you there. that's you're making a mess. No, I'm not, dude. Look. You, oh my god, y'all. Pray, pray, pray for me, y'all. You do it. You want me to put a little more? No. They want to see me do more. Seven, you got me? Mm-mm. <laughs> that should be the thumbnail right there. That's so ugly. <laughs> On top now, you know, a lot of people don't know you see, you're seasoning your water helps flavor your food, yes, right? Yes. A lot of people don't know that. Season right. your water a little bit. So we're going to add, actually, can you get a pot holder? Let's pull this forward. Your pot holders, but remember, oh, he, he designed this kitchen so he know where everything oh. is. <laughs> I, I tell you what. Okay. Ain't I'm, that like a hard-headed woman and a soft-hearted man? So I'm putting this, I'm putting this broccoli <laughs> in here. You got, to, you got the fire? I'll turn it on, Mom. All right. Y'all, I'm having fun with him in the kitchen, though. We but. really, it, what, in all, all seriousness, we really enjoy hanging out with each other in the kitchen. It gives us an opportunity all to All seriousness, just, all seriousness. All seriousness. It gives us an opportunity to just hang out, Serious. chill with each other, and just bond. As if we don't bond enough. We work together, we play together. One time, D.L. Hughley say, I don't know how y'all do that. He did. Like, he said, how y'all ride to work? Y'all ride to work together? Y'all go. Yes. Yeah. We, we enjoy do. each other's company. We do. We like it. Okay, so I'm gonna add some um, I'm gonna add some butter on here, y'all. Okay, a little butter on it. And I'm gonna put a little bit more seasoning. Okay, actually. Well, I'll put the seasoning. They Wait. like the way I do. Wait. We gotta make sure we have enough broccoli. You know we got people. That's good, mom. That's enough. You you don't have enough room in there. Man, this is a big old pot. So you want this to melt down, so you try to put it work on everything. Do I so need to put more season? Mm, just a yeah, bit. it needs a little bit more. Come, but it, <laughs> when he just told me doing stuff wrong in the kitchen, that's wrong. When you're doing seasoning, don't go up high. The reason I say don't go up high is because you it spreads and you and have- you make a mess. Everywhere. But you don't have to worry about messes. That's because- He just messes. Look at that. Our friends over at Bounty I'm, just made it all. I out. want you to be like this when the camera and not on. What? Clean up? Clean up like that when the camera ain't on though. See? <laughs> 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 he, he just be, he be hating. We're gonna let this steam a little bit. We ain't gonna let this cook too long because we don't want this to uh, get too soft. Okay, we're gonna let that clean, we're gonna let that do what it do. All right, y'all. Hey, we're gonna clean up. We're gonna let this steam, then we're gonna come back. And we're gonna be plating this up so we can eat. Be back. Look good and smell good. Taste, taste good. good. I ain't tasted yet, but it's gonna taste good. It's though. gotta taste good. It's gonna taste good. It's gonna be all the good. All the good. But you know what? Thank y'all so much for hanging out with us in Mama Man's Kitchen. Thank you for my back by popular D Man, David Man. And we wanna thank PG and its brands for partnering with us. With Bounty, Zevo, Tide. You know what? Y'all doing it. Look. He, he white, because he messed that up. For early. now. He but up. thank them for helping us in the kitchen as we continue our road to the Stellas mm -hmm. right here. P&G, thank you for helping us celebrate what, what moves, moves us, us, our community, our food, our beauty, and our joy. Thank you, P&G. Thank you so much. Go to pggoodeveryday.com to see how P&G and its brand help you shine your light. In your kitchen, in your home, and wherever you move. Y'all, we about to taste this because it look good, it smell good. And I know it tastes good. I know it tastes good. For the Beyond Meat people. Oh my God. Let me see. My God. Let me be the judge of that. Mm-hmm. Woo! What you said? 
Hey. Right there. Right there. That's good right there. Hey y'all, check out my new single, Working For Me. I'm so excited, y'all. Just check it out. Okay, we're gonna play a little bit for you. Listen to this song on our way out, y'all. Working For Me. Yeah.